And their fellow Russians next, Stolpova and Klimov, the Olympic silver medalist from 2014. Second place after the short program, just about four and a half points out of first. Both from St. Petersburg, Russia, now living and training in Moscow. Long way to catch Sui and Han as the leaders, but an outside shot of getting to the top step of the podium. They start off with their most difficult element, the triple twist. The improvements they've made on that element since Cup of Russia. And obviously much better on the throw triple flip. ton of points here in the side-by-side -side pass. Triple toe, triple toe, bobbles on both of the landings, but the starting point value is so high on a triple-triple combination, they will still get a lot for that pass. Side-by-side, side, triple South Cows. Wild on the landing. One element remaining, the last moment throw, triple Sao Cao that gave them trouble at Cup of Russia. 
gorgeous landing here in Japan. Poised to take the lead. Stobova and Klimov. Olympic silver medalist from 2014, second at the Grand Prix of Russia recently, and now looking for the lead in Osaka at the Grand Prix of Japan. A much improved performance from what we saw at Cup of Russia. Take a look at that moment at the top of the twist. You see that hesitation before that rotation starts to snap, making it so difficult to get a clean catch. That free arm has to wrap around the waist. You lose quite a bit on the grade of execution when that catch does not look clean but they get their points with their side-by-side -side jumping, the speed through those throws, and being able to fly through this program from start to finish. That's their strength, and that's what they're starting to find again. And this is a very good time to be picking up momentum. The last three weeks were so crucial for them. They had to go home take a look at what they were doing well and what they were not doing well. And they made a lot of adjustments just in time for this Grand Prix at NHK in Japan because they needed to. They know that with the other Russian teams skating well, they cannot rest on their laurels. And they came out, did beautiful throws. The side-by-side -side jumps, even though they got a little sloppy, on the triple toe, triple toes, the starting point value is just so high that it makes it very difficult for them, for the other teams rather, to be able to catch on an element like that. And it was much better than we saw in Russia. So if they can hit that triple toe, triple toe, double toe cleanly, like we've seen them do in the past, that's when those scores are gonna start getting up into the upper 140s again which they know is what they need if they want to be standing on the podium in Pyeongchang. 184.78 is their season's best total score. Wow, season's best free right there. They have reached their season's best in free skating. That's the kind of score that's going to put pressure on Sui and Han. They're, Sui and Han are capable of getting into the 150s, but they know that they cannot make mistakes with a 147 out there. Easily a season's best for the Russians here, well over 200 points. And now the leaders with one pair left to go.